Hi, this is Robin Moses, and I'm here with Juan the bunny. Oh my gosh, is that not the cutest bunny you ever seen ever? We love you. We love you. So there's Juan, and I am going to do an Easter tutorial. Here's. Okay, so I'm here with Compassionista and all of her wonderful lion head rabbits, and I might take one because I love them, but I don't know because I might get in trouble. And so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need another animal like somebody else I'm sitting with right now. I've started this tutorial with um, OPI. Let me tell you. This purple is called Lost My Bikini and Molokini. Ooh. And this pink is called Susie Shops and Island Hops Pink. And then I used um, the Berry Thought of You purple. And then I used an Azatur tea. With my brush, I'm just going to push push, 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 pull up. Then with the other side, push, push, pull up. Like that. And it's almost like he's looking down. I mean, I mean he's upside down looking. Oi! Okay. And then, with that same gray, go over the head. Now this is going to take a couple coats because it's so it's has to be very very um, uh, covered covered. There we go. Okay, so you push and then you push 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 and then pull up and then you take a light line and then you then you push 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 pull up. Then with the white white. We're going to do his feet. Now, the, the feet are going to be closer to us, so they're going to be lighter. So we're going to do like that. One foot, and then his other foot. Ah. And I kind of want them kind of mix-matched a little tiny bit. But see how those, they look closer because they're whiter? When it dries, this is going to make sense more. Okay, so now I'm going to go into here and I'm going to do the rest of the nails like an Easter egg design and um, and I am just I'm just pulling in all different kinds of beautiful colors and um, gosh, what are we doing? We're just we're just uh, doing it up. So push and pull and push and pull up and push and pull and push the Easter egg uh, dies and everything you can get really dark beautiful colors and everything so it really is up to you how far you want to take this see if it doesn't cover the first time you just go in again so that's what exactly what I'm doing I'm just doing each one as an Easter egg design and I'll meet you back okay. <laughs> Okay, so let me back up a little without like showing off my huge mess. Okay, now I'm going in lastly with this one. Um, just a argyle in Easter colors. And then with two little black spots, we're just going to make two little peeking eyes so that it's looking out. Maybe the top of a nose only. Like that. Okay? That's the one. Now see that's a very very simple way to make a bunny. You can do that on any length of nail and it's very cute. Just a little peaky bunny. On the other side, not quite so peaky. I'm going to go in with a white face on this one so that he looks more 3D. Like a little uh, a uh, 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 stuffed animal. And then I'm going to go and fill in his belly like that. Then I'm going to go in and fill in his ears and I'm just using pure white now. The gray is almost dry. It doesn't have to be completely dry. I did these pretty fast. And then with my pink I'm going to make it a little bit darker perhaps. I'm going to put in one, two, three, and then dot the foot. <laughs> Isn't that cute? Isn't that? And then 
One, two, three. Compassionista, is that what a bottom of that bunny's foot looks like? Pretty close. Perfect. Okay. So then with the same little black eye so that they look like they're related, I want them to be like this. And then uh, with the pink nose. Oops. Pink nose. And then little black. Remember, thin your paint. The thinner the better. You don't want thick paint because you're not going to be able to get these tiny lines. That. And then I'm going to do the little middle of the ears right here so it looks like it's folded over. And then coming out the side, just a little tiny hands like so that it looks like it's on something. Then I'm going to put a little tiny purple cloth down so it looks like he's um, sitting on a blanket or something because I, okay, for people who don't know my channel, I do not like nail art that floats. <laughs> it's a pet peeve. <laughs> I can't float a bunny. He has to be sitting. Okay, and here is the finished product. I am going to go one by one with this one because it's kind of complex. Okay, but just take it one at a time. I covered with a Dazzle Dry matte top coat. You can get that at DazzleDry.com. And I just used a whole bunch of different kinds of swirlies and lines and argyle and bunnies and swirlies and designs and hearts and stars and all different kinds of stuff. Perfect for Easter egg and Easter. So I did get an Easter design out there this year. I was really, really scared I wasn't going to be able to with everything going on in my life. And so I'm very happy. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. You can see me at Robin Moses Nail Art on Pinterest, Instagram, and Facebook. And I will see you back with more. Everybody have a great Easter. Bye! Bye. Woo!